Hey, hey, welcome to day 29 of 365 Days of Style. The kids decided they were going to make a fort inside because it's so cold outside, so that's what we got going on here. I wanna share with you the outfit that I have going on. I stretched myself a little bit to pull out some unique things that I have not worn in a little while because I wanna make the most out of my closet too. So let's start off with these pants. These pants are fantastic. I've had them for a few years. They're a basic black with almost a Baroque style pattern in the sheen that catches the light, almost making them look leather. They're really a jegging. They're fabulous. I have on a tweed vest. Yes, I wore one yesterday, but I've heard that when you're learning a new language, if you hear the same word within five minutes of just hearing it, it really sticks in your mind. So I figured I'd share with you guys, if you wear tweed, and I'm wearing it two days in a row, it might stick for you too. So I put the tweed vest on over a long sleeve sweater. It's one of my basic fitted styles that I tend to wear underneath other items. So I love some fitted pieces just for that even to wear underneath vests so you don't get too much bulk. I had to put on my Burberry scarf with this just to bring in a bit of the color tones that I like to wear for my skin tone right up next to my face. This particular tie is really simple. I'll share with you at the end of this video. And the last thing that I have. This is where I really stretched myself today because I have not worn these shoes yet, but I think they're really funky and cool. They're a platform style flat, and yes, I realize we are in the middle of winter, but they almost have like a sneaker bottom to them, making them pretty nice for this weather, and I wanted to bring in a shoe that kind of jazzed up my outfit a little bit today. So there you go. There is my day 29 of 365 days of style. Tweet. Get yourself some tweet. All right, here's how you go ahead and tie this particular scarf. It's actually just an oblong scarf. It's not even a square. And so I basically folded it in half lengthwise, and then I took it and folded it into a triangle. I realize that your triangle points are asymmetrical, but that's okay. You can just really work with it. And then in this particular one, I just brought it in the front, crossed it in the back, and tucked my ends underneath my vest. They're not even tied, but I know since my, my vest has some weight to it and I'm also wearing a sweater that's kind of a little sticky, that it's gonna stay right there in place. I wanted the scarf just to nestle right in to the collar of my tweed vest right here. And so then you just mess with it a little bit, turn it a little sideways, and you've got the point kind of going down here too. And there we go. That's how I tied my oblong scarf into a triangle work with this outfit.